in the featherweight division at UFC Vegas 89. You got Brazilian Ricardo Ramos taking on Julian Juicy J. Arosa. He's 20, 28 and 12. Ramos, 16 and 5. Arosa, pretty tall for a featherweight, 6'1. He's four inches taller than Ramos. That's about normal uh, for Arosa, really. He's 34. Ramos, just 28. Wow. 21 professional fights at 28. Erosa, three inch reach advantage. He's southpaw. Ramos, right handed. Erosa doubles him up in activity. 6.2 significant strikes per minute to 3.2 for Ramos. Takedown game. Ramos almost won every round. Erosa, like, won every other round. That's going to become important in this fight. Ramos, 72% takedown defense. Erosa, 61% takedown defense. So keep those in your hip pocket. Ramos lost to Charles. Air Jordan in his last fight by submission. Beat Danny Chavez before that uh, by spinning back elbow KO first round. So he's 1-1 one one in the last two. On the other hand, Arosa has lost two in a row to Alice Caceres. Good fighter. First round KO. Fernando Padilla also on this card. First round KO. So not a good look there for him. And something just tells me that Ramos is going to win this fight. I mean, he's just going to be more dominant on the ground. It's always tough when guys have less significant strikes, but if the ground game overrides that, you got to take a look at that. Hopefully, Ramos gets the finish to make that happen to move to 17-5 featherweight division, UFC Vegas 89.